Alright, this tutorial is going to cover how to use the CDU to enter in waypoints uh, using UTM coordinates. This is going to help us uh, navigate a lot easier and find targets easier. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to find the coordinates we need. Um, right here you can see we have an enemy aircraft at Novo Airfield. So let's go ahead and zoom on into this. Alright, so the coordinates for this aircraft are on the top left of the map right now. You can see it says 37, Tango, Delta Kilo, and a bunch of numbers. The important parts of the coordinate is going to be the Delta Kilo, 027, 15, 466, 81. And the elevation is going to be 131 feet. That's all the information we need to write down because that's very important. You'll use it here in a moment. Um, now, once again, the top left, you can see my coordinates, they are in UTM mode. By default, DCS has your coordinates in long lap mode. In order to switch to UTM mode, you have to go into your option menu on the main menu. Alright, let's move over to the aircraft. Alright, let's change our right MFD to the CDU page. Now, you can see on the CDU that on the bottom right, it has L slash L. That stands for long lap. We're not using long lat, we're using UTM. So you're going to hit the OSB right beside long lat to switch to UTM mode. We're also going to come down to our CDU and over here on the steer point dial, we're going to make sure it's on flight plan. Over here on the page dial, we're going to make sure it's on other. So we have everything set up. Let's go ahead and enter in the coordinates. They were Delta Kilo 027 15. 466-81. Okay, on the MFD, on the uh, left row of OSBs, we're going to hit the bottom one to enter in the coordinate. Now we're going to set the elevation also. It was 1, 3, 1. And using the third OSB from the bottom on the left side, we're going to type in the elevation. Alright, so we typed in all the important information. Now we need to generate this actual waypoint. So on the right side of the MFD, we're going to hit the second from bottom OSB, where it says 2, to create a new waypoint. And we created the new waypoint. Now we're going to give it a name by going to the CDU over here. Type in A, B, C, 1, 2, 3. And on the MFD, on the right side, OSB is the second from the top OSB. We click that to give it a name. And we just gave it a name. Now to access this waypoint in our CDU, we have to change our steer point dial over here to mission. Alright, so let's go ahead and zoom out. We're going to make our HUD soy by using Cooley Hat Up. We're also going to use our DMS Up short to switch over to ABC123. Okay, now let's bring up our TGP real quick. We're going to use China Hat Forward Long to slew everything to our current waypoint. And as you can see, oops, there we go. And as you can see, there is the aircraft. So once again, we just went over how to enter UTM coordinates into the CDU to create waypoints.